Hello and welcome to City Trekker. My name's Adam and I'll be your guide as we aim to find the right gear for the right task for you. Today we're going to take a look at the Bellroy Transit Plus, Transit Backpack, and Transit Work Pack. Let's check them out. This video is sponsored by Western Rise and I've been a big fan of theirs for a few years now and I'm thrilled to have them as a sponsor. I'm wearing the X Cotton T Adapt Quarter Zip uh, Airloft Vest and the Airloft Hooded Jacket. And this Airloft Hooded Jacket is awesome. I've been wearing it a ton this last month and it's been keeping me cozy. It's got an interior pocket, two pockets, and a large back pocket. And you can actually tuck the entire jacket into that back pocket. Check out my unboxing video to see more. I've worn this jacket in temperatures as low as 20 degrees Fahrenheit and it held up pretty well. I also wore it in the autumn in temperatures up to 70 degrees and it wasn't too hot. But I would say over 70 degrees or high 60s in the sun is gonna feel a little bit warm. I love this jacket. It's now one of my favorite jackets and I wear it a ton. I can get you 15% off of this jacket and any Western Rise product using my link down below. So a big shout out and thanks to Western Rise for sponsoring this video. Bellroy was founded by designers Andrew and Hadrian and engineers Lena and Matthew in 2009. They launched with some wallets in their first year and then expanded into bags and accessories. Bellroy is a B corporation with a recycled fabrics program and is based in Melbourne, Australia. Their transit line backpacks are extremely popular and I thought I would review all three at once since they share a lot of similarities. The transit work pack is 20 liters, the transit backpack is 28 liters, and the transit plus is 38 liters. They will each hold a 16 inch laptop. They use water resistant recycled materials and have a three year warranty. As you can see, the Transit Backpack is in black and the Work Pack and the Transit Plus are in the beta blue. So let's get into all three of these bags starting with the outside. All right, so let's talk about these materials. The marine blue bags are a Bita nylon. This is a recycled material. It feels really great and is extremely durable. And the black bag is a Dura nylon. Now all of these are recycled materials and Bellroy has a page on their website where they just talk about their materials. Now we also have YKK zippers and leather accents on the bag. These are great materials and well-designed bags. On the lower front, we've got a leather accent with the Bellroy logo. There's a thin front pocket on all of these with side zipper accents. Access. You can see you've got a bit of a lip on the marine blue bags, uh, but the transit backpack does not have one. And then around the front, we have access to the main compartment. Now on the backs here, we've got some good padding, uh, minimal padding on the work pack. You've got more padding on the transit backpack with this ribbed material here, and then more of the same on the Transit Plus, uh, wider padding here. The Transit Plus also has a pass-through and a side carry handle. All three bags have water bottle pockets on the wings here, and they are very discreet and will fit very large water bottles, but that will eat into the main compartment of the bag. Now on the Transit Plus at the bottom, we also have a waist strap that comes out. So there's a little bit of padding on the waist strap, and then it has a magnetic clasp. You also have a strap keeper on either side. I really like this waist strap. I don't use it a lot unless I need it, but it is a great option to have if you do. When you don't need it, it easily tucks away and just adds to the lower padding. All right, the shoulder straps on these are pretty comfortable. I like all of them. The work pack is only 20 liters, so you've only got a little padding here, but I find it to be sufficient. I just wish it had a sternum strap like the other two do, and their new pack, the Venture Backpack, does have a sternum strap and is just slightly larger than the work pack. The Transit Backpack has some really great padding here and a magnetic clasp for the sternum strap. The Transit Plus straps are even thicker and also have a magnetic clasp. Top of the bags have a quick access pocket as well as a top handle. So let me try each of these bags on for you, starting with the work pack. I am six foot three, 180 pounds. This is the Transit Backpack. And this is the Transit Plus Backpack. So that's about it for the outside. Let's get into these bags. And before we do, I'd love for you to triple click for me. Click the like button, subscribe button, and ring that bell to check out all our future reviews. Thanks. All right, so in the front, we've got this quick access pocket. And there's a little bit of organization in here. We've got just a, a small pocket on the work pack. 
And then this goes down to uh, right about here and all the way to the top. On the transit work pack, we've got a little bit more organization on the inside. Uh, we've got this clip for your keys. We've got two spots for like pens and flashlight, uh, a pocket here. And this goes all the way to the side and all the way down to here and all the way to the top. Then in the Transit Plus, we've got an even larger pocket here with a little bit of organization, slightly different. We've got some pockets here on the sides for pens, a pocket near the top, and then the rest is pretty open. And this goes from the top all the way to the side and then down to the bottom here. The water bottle pockets on the side are quite large and uh, I believe it'll fit a full one liter Nalgene. Yeah, it just gobbles that up. So even the smaller work pack will fit a one liter Nalgene. So just keep in mind, if you use these water bottle pockets, they are going to eat into the main compartment of the bag just a little bit, but it really does add to the sleek design of the bag. At the top, we've got this quick access pocket. The quick access pocket on the Transit backpack is a little bit larger than the work pack. And then the quick access pocket on the Transit Plus is a little bit larger. All three of these bags open up full clamshell, so let's see the inside. So here's the inside on the work pack. We've got a tablet sleeve uh, that really could also be used for shoes. Then on the Transit and Transit Plus, we have these straps that can be used uh, to hold down clothing or other items for when you're packing. The inside sides of the Transit Plus also have additional pockets. So we've got a large pocket here and a zipped pocket on this side. So the Transit backpack is 28 liters, which is a great size for short travel. And the Transit Plus being 38 liters is great for longer travel or international travel. Now the inside of the work pack, we've got a small top pocket with this mesh. The top of the Transit backpack, we've got a smaller top pocket and then a full zipped pocket. The Transit Plus, we've got a small top pocket and then a full zipped pocket under this mesh. The zippers on the main compartment of the Transit Plus do have these loops where you can put them together and put a lock through here, which just adds some additional security for when you're traveling. Now at the top, we also have access to the laptop compartment. This is a suspended sleeve and will fit a 16 inch laptop. And what I love about this is there's a front section right here where you can stick your charging cables, chargers, and all that kind of stuff. Here it is on the Transit backpack, and it's actually zipped shut this front section for your cables and chargers. The Transit Plus laptop compartment also suspended, and this front section in here is zipped shut for your chargers and cables. And I love that there's separate laptop access on all of these bags. So that's everything on the inside of the bags. Now the Bellroy Transit Work Pack and the Bellroy Venture Backpack are very similar bags with just a few differences. The Work Pack has a separate zippered laptop compartment accessible from the back, as well as full clamshell access to the main compartment. The Venture Laptop access comes from the main compartment. And access to the main compartment is different. You've got this hook that has to be undone, lifted up, and then you can access the laptop here and then you can fully open it using these zippers on both sides. They both have top quick access pockets. I think the one on the Venture might be a little bit larger. On the back, we've got similar padding on the back, but the shoulder straps are quite different. So we have more padding on the shoulder strap on the Venture backpack. We definitely have more padding on the Venture backpack shoulder strap, as well as a sternum strap. The zipper pulls on these are different and there's a few other minor things, but those are the main differences between these two bags. I have a tough time coming up with negatives for these bags because I think they're so awesome, but I do have two. Even though the work pack is only 20 liters, I wish it came with a sternum strap. I think any bag 18, 20 liters or more should come with a sternum strap uh, because you don't know how much you're gonna be carrying with you and you might be carrying something really heavy. The second negative is where the main compartment opens up down here at the bottom. It would be nice to have some tabs down here where you could grab the tab when you're unzipping the pack. Those are the only negatives I can really come up with because these bags are so well made. I just love this marine blue Bida nylon. I've been getting a few of their products in it and I just think it's awesome. This work pack has been one of my favorite bags for a long time now and the Transit Plus has been awesome for travel. So these are the Bellroy Transit backpacks, the work pack, the Transit pack, and the Transit Plus. They are well designed, well made, and I have really enjoyed using all of these bags. I've owned all three of these bags for well over a year and I've used them a lot. 
I got my wife a work pack and she's been using it for the last year and loves it. Every time I show my wife a Bellroy product, she says, man, they know what they're doing. So this is a great company. They've got a great warranty and they have great solid products. So that's it, the Bellroy Transit Backpacks the work pack, the transit backpack, and the transit plus. I hope you enjoyed this interview and if you did, please click the like button down below and subscribe to the channel to check out all our future reviews. Thanks so much and take care.